This is for all of you who worked as uh, redcoats for Butlins during the Butlins heyday, and it's called the Redcoats Lament. There's a camp at Barry Island, there's another one at Hare, there's also one at Clacton in the east, where we signed on as redcoats and we didn't have a care. Once we passed the main gate, that all ceased. For they took away our civvies, and they gave us red and whites, and a name badge just in case we were unsure. With a striped tie for the daytime, and a bow tie for the nights, and a broom for a horse to sweep the floor. There's a sunny camp at Bogner. And at Minehead it's the same, though in Skegness the sea breeze is keenly felt. There's a vast one at Pathwelly, which is not an easy name. No one's ever certain how it's spelled. Where we made first sitting breakfast, and we almost made a smile, though we'd only had an hour or two in bed. From the chalet to the dining hall is nearly half a mile. So we wish we'd gone self-catering instead. There's a hotel right in Blackpool, and in Brighton just outside, and in Scarborough it's perched high above the bay. In Cliftonville the buildings are all scattered far and wide, where finally ends we really couldn't say. Where we read the daily details, with sad and sinking hearts We can't do ballroom dancing, we insist And we buggered up the by sheet For the snooker and the dance And tried to catch some shut-eye at the west We've been chased as Captain Blood By kids three times around the camp We've been thrown at Donkey Derby in the dirt we filled in tell your friends cards till it gave us writer's cramp and pushed car raffle tickets till it hurt. We slept in metal double bunks in case you didn't know, which tend to shake and rattle under stress. And if you're on the top one while your mate has sex below, it's like sleeping on the Edinburgh Express. Tried to pull this week's Miss She or Holiday Princess Or even Lovely Legs, but never can And though there's many redcoat lads who bragged of their success They never even made the glamorous grand We've organized the knobbly knees, we've won the redcoat cup Wished somehow we could fix the filmed horse race And we stood through national talent heats where 32 turned up and 26 performed Amazing Grace. For 16 hours, 6 days a week, we scarcely made a mint. Came up with skills and things we'd not been shown. So often we were knackered, and too often we were skinned. And dreamed of when we'd eat a meal alone. But then there were the sing-alongs, the running gags, the laughs, the red coat show, the Friday au revoir. When people bought your photo and kids asked for autographs, that's when you knew how it felt to be a star.